Hey everybody, Leslie from discoveryfabrics.com. I'm gonna do a quick lesson today just showing some of our many wicking fabrics. I do get a lot of questions on our Facebook group from people who are wondering what I'm talking about when I say wicking. Um, moisture wicking means that the fabric is a performance fabric that pulls the water from your skin and it, it basically spreads it across the surface of the fabric. As opposed to say a natural fabric like cotton, cotton actually does pull water from your skin a certain amount, but it sucks the water inside the fibers rather than spreading them across the surface and therefore it doesn't dry out again very quickly. So it can become really uncomfortable. So I'm just gonna show, this is just such a small sampling of the wicking fabrics that we have, but I wanna show you just a few and how that works. This fabric is, um, is a power dry fabric now there's two different ways that fabrics wick. One is that it's a mechanical wicking and a mechanical wicking means that the design of the yarns before it's even made into to, uh, fabric is small yarn and large yarn fibers that are bonded together in some kind of a fashion. It's a patented process by many companies so they don't always explain how it's done. But what it does is it causes a capillary action, just like if you were to put um, a, a wick of a candle down on some water and it would kind of slurp it up. It's because it's drawing it in. And the, the size of the fibers actually creates that action in mechanical wicking. And the other kind of wicking is um, a synthetic wicking or a chemical wicking, where they basically just take the fabrics and they put them in some kind of solution that causes them to pull moisture when, uh, when it comes in contact. So here's my water, queen of everything. Didn't buy that for myself, <laughs> but I guess I could have. So what I'm gonna do is just show the back side of the power dry, which is the very smooth. You see the face of the fabric has a little bit of a design to it in this particular style. And when I put the water on it, it just starts to spread. So it'll just keep spreading and spreading and probably doesn't show up too well on navy fabric. The next fabric I'm gonna show you is brand new to us. This is called Performance. Uh, it's a performance jersey and it's called Tech, tech jersey. jersey. And we actually made this pair of pants out of Tech Jersey. So this is a really lightweight, super duper stretch fabric, but it's also moisture wicking. So we consider it to be one of our base layers. And again, if I'm just to put the back side of the fabric here, a little bit of water and see how it spreads. It's just, it's going really fast. It's spreading all over the place. And if fabric isn't wicking, you'll notice that it usually repels a certain amount. This is Mitty Nailhead. Actually, I haven't tried the wicking on this before, so we're gonna see what it's like together. It says that it's a wicking fabric. Ooh, is it ever? Okay. Yeah, just suck that in. Now, it's not spreading as quickly as the Power Dry, um, or the performance, the performance tech, but it is a moisture wicking fabric and this is actually very good to make leggings out of. It's very stretchy four by four. And this is called the nail head and very, very durable. So you, this would be something you would do for a legging or a hoodie. This is Polar Tech as well. And in addition to being a power dry, they call the, these series that have the, um, the waffle on the back or the grid on the back, power grid. Now it not only wicks by the, um, the slurping or capillary action of these little squares, but it also um, spreads through these channels. So it's actually quite technical fabric. So you can see how quickly that's moving across the surface of the fabric. So if you were to make uh, a shirt for biking or something out of this or long underwear or just a regular shirt, um, a lot of uh, fabrics I wear that are performance fabrics, I just wear every day because I, I like the fact that they keep me cool and dry. This is one of our killer fabrics. This is Polar Tech Delta. Now Delta, again, in addition to being a moisture wicking mechanical fabric is also a cooling fabric. So Polar Tech has patented the technology for this. It was designed for the military and it will actually cool you when you're sweating. And the also something that I just found out about Delta is that it um, is less friction on the body. So if you find that you're, you're having a running shirt and you're getting a lot of soreness just from the movement of the fabric on your skin, Delta's the solution for that. It's really, really cool fabric. 
in many different ways. And Delta has really high sun protection, I think minimum 50. The next fabric is one that we just got in, brand new. Again, it's Polar Tech. We do love Polar Tech fabrics. This is Power Wool, but it's also a Power Grid because it has the grid on the back. So they've used the same technology from the Power Grid in the Power Wool, and it's a merino synthetic blend. It, ha it doesn't itch on your skin at all, so you get the, all the benefits of wool, which are antimicrobial and, and other benefits, the warmth. And on this very, very light weight, it's just gonna keep you really dry and comfortable. And I'll show you the wicking on power wool. See, it's spreading very quickly. And you see that the power grid in the channels, it's actually traveling in the channels as well. Very neat technology. And I'm actually wearing a power wool tank. That, and I've mentioned before that sometimes you think wool is just for winter, but I love this. And it's, I'll show you how it wicks as well. And my, my shop is probably, I don't know, 30 degrees Celsius or 80 at least Fahrenheit. Very, very hot. So it's a very neat fabric and it doesn't, I'm not too hot wearing this even though it's a really hot day in the shop. So that's all I wanted to show you today. Um, you know, if you have any questions, you can always call us or email us or, or talk on Facebook about the fabric technologies. And we're just here to train you and to educate and hopefully help you make a selection that you're going to make something that you're gonna wear for years and years that's gonna be super functional for you. So thanks for tuning in and I'll see you later.